guys, today I have a Boots haul for you. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine products to talk about. Um, that makes sense because it's currently three for two on everything, so I did totally weigh that. Um, so it should be a fairly quick video. I love watching Boots hauls and Super Drugs hauls. I just love to see what's popping out of the bag each time. I don't know why. I'll try to go quickly. I won't ramble on too much. Uh, don't hold me to that. But um, yeah, let's start now. Okay, so the first product I'm going to rave about is this Bourjois Healthy Mix, which is like a gel foundation. I'm in the shade 53, which is like a light beige. Um, I tried it on in the shop. Um, it felt so so nice on my skin um, and the lady tried to say I was a 55 shade I don't know why women do that like when they know that you're a different ethnicity they're just like brown 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 and they literally try and shove you like the brownest the darkest sh uh, foundation and I'm like woman please I am not you know like I don't have a problem with being brown whatever but you know please stop being stupid and give me the one that I said I want to try on my face. So, oh, ooh, popular. Um, oh, it's T-Mobile, fuck. <laughs> um, okay, so basically, but she was very nice and she didn't mean to intentionally annoy me. She was just a very annoying sales lady that was trying to be so helpful that it was like, go away, woman. <laughs> the Real Techniques Stippling Brush. Okay, I was really excited about this. Um, like, when I say everything in... Boots is three for two, including the makeup brushes. So if you haven't tried the Real Techniques brushes, now is the chance to beg your parents or to like buy yourself um, the brushes. Like I totally recommend the core collection, which is the face, and I totally recommend what's it called, the eye collection, because I I use the eye stuff every single day. Um, I also have the Expert Face Brush and the Blusher Brush and I love them so, so much. And now I've got the Stippling Brush, so I've got so many brushes and I don't know what I'm going to do with them all except for make them look pretty in my jars, okay? I got the Soap and Glory Kick-Ass Concealer. I got it in the shade Medium because um, I thought the light one would be too light for me, like, I don't know, it looked very weird when I put it on my skin. So um, I'll open it up and you can have a little look. Looks like this. Don't you just love the packaging? Isn't it like totally kick ass? Uh, sorry about the sun on my face. It looks a bit silly. So yeah, I totally love that. Basically what it has is a setting powder. So you know when you put your concealer on, you literally set it with that. And then, I don't know how, right, I make a fool of myself every time I try and get in. Oh, there it is. Okay. Um, yeah, and there's the concealers here. I don't know which one's which. I'm going to mix them both together because I don't really have blemishes around my face. It's mainly this vein here that I like to cover. I've got like a blue vein on my face. And um, I like to cover my heavy dark circles. They are awful and ugly and I hate them. But yeah, I, I think this will do the trick. So I'm going to mix them both together because I think both of them together will be the shade of my colour um, under my eyes. And... It shall be pretty cool. It's got a little mirror as well, so you can see yourself. Oh, there I am. Uh, sorry. Begin <laughs> with Soap and Glory, why not? I bought this, which is the Soap and Glory You Won't Believe Your Eyes Tired Eye Brightening Moisture Serum. Now, I wouldn't say I'm really pale, but I've got light skin. And um, my eyes, my under eyes, are disgustingly black. I don't know if you can see, but... They're really ugly and horrible, and I hate dark circles. They are my worst nightmare that I have to battle with every flipping morning. I've got such crappy under eyes. Um, I went to Bobby Brown to try and get concealer because everyone raves about their um, corrector, under eye corrector, and the lady goes, um, you've got very dry, um, dehydrated eyes. Maybe that's why your um, dark circles are like they are. And I was like, yeah, I see where you're going with this. You're going to try and make me spend £30 on one of your creams. <laughs> so I was just like pretending that I don't have dehydrated, de dehydrated under eyes. Who am I kidding, right? And then straight after that, that's where I went to Boots and I bought this. Um, it's so cool, right? 
I'm, I'm the annoying person that opens all the packaging up, like if I sincerely want to buy something. And look, it's like this. And what you do is you squeeze it a little and you massage it under your eyes. Um, and even here, I guess you can. And um, I reckon this is gonna be pretty cool. I've not read any reviews on it. It's literally like I just bought it and I am now thinking, should I have? Um, Cause it was quite, expensive like for me because I'm a student like I can't spend 30 pounds on a uh, face cream it would burn me to use it like every time I put a cream that like an expensive cream like that on my face I'll be like that's two pounds going on my skin right now like I would rather spend my money on food like it's so much that I would eat healthy rather than spend my money on face paint really <laughs> Am I just going to be pissing off a lot of you? I think so, right? <laughs> okay, so I thought, right, because, um, like, these are my real lashes that I have now. So, um, as you can see, they kind of can go wrong because they're, like, really long and weird. And sometimes I have disastrous moments with my mascara and I look like spider lashes lady. Um, <sighs> yeah, so I thought I'd be daring. Dun, 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 dun. And bought these Ilo, um, Ilo, Ilo individual lashes. Um, and basically, I like these because you don't need a glue for them. Like, what pees me off is like, I look at all these lashes at Boots, in Boots, sorry. And um, yeah, you need to buy like lash glue, and it's like, it just works out so expensive. And I'm like, I just, I must sound like such a cheap cow to you guys, sorry, but it's the truth. Um, so I decided to get these because they've got like the glue thing stuck on. So you literally get the tweezers, you pick them out and you stick it on. No messing around with glue, no bother, no faff. It's just so simple and easy and that is what we like in this house, right? Right now I've got a um, black eyeliner on my eyes, but... I don't like to put black on my eyes like every day so I like to kind of make them look a bit more open um, and so I bought um, this Scandal Eyes by Rimmel um, waterproof coal cardial which is in the shade nude so it's this one here and basically it's really cool because when you put it on your waterline it really can you see it there looks a bit like conceal like a concealer colour um, it's really cool and you basically put it on your water waterline and your eyes pop but they don't look so um, like I've tried putting white on my waterline and I didn't feel like it looked good like I felt like it looked like I had powder in my eye I don't know I don't know don't ask so I thought I'd get something a bit more natural looking which is this and um, apparently this is like God sent for putting on the waterline you know, every time I've gone to uh, to both Superdrug and Boots to try and find this, they're either all damaged by the people that rip off the packaging and don't use the testers, so annoying, um, or they um, they just never have it in stock. So I assume this is really good. It's not just me that thinks so. Um, I then bought the um, Rimmel Apocalypse Lip Lacquer, which is in the shade where's the sun gone right which is in the shade um nude eclipse and this is a really pretty color um it's like a peachy nude i'm planning on doing a top um 10 maybe or top five um lipsticks or lip products for fall and this baby is gonna be in it it's so nice it's like a peachy nude you probably can't see it now because the sun's like um there we go it's like a peachy nude and it's so so pretty um it's really nice like because you get the nudes that are really weird to have on your skin like i don't know like you know what i mean bought a um, color tattoo 24 hour by eye studio and this is in the color taupe um it's so pretty it looks like this see like a very natural everyday color for your eyes, um, I'm not going to swatch it because I'm really sad and I want to take a picture for my blog when I set it up. I've still not set it up. Can you believe that? Okay, lastly, finally, I bought this from Natural Collection. It's $1.99 full price, right? Um, and it's the Duo Eyeshadow Fragrance Free. And I bought it because I thought 
that brown would be like a perfect eyeshadow um eyeshadow a perfect powder for my eyebrows which I think they are like I used it on my eyebrows today you see and um yeah like why am I backing off from you if I'm so confident about it I'll be like look so I use that 199 yep screw you Mac I'm not spending 10 pounds for your ash brown eyeshadow would I get sued for def defamation now oops <laughs> right thanks for watching guys I hope you've liked this video if you have please like and possibly subscribe um and I will see you next time. <laughs> I was going to say, if not, then. And I was like, oh no, don't go down that route. Don't give them a chance to say why they don't like you. <laughs> yeah. Um. Right. I'll see you next time. And goodbye. See ya. <laughs>